Hey, are you tired of clunky dashboard or windshield mount that gets in the way? Well, check out this magnetic car mount from Vixseed. What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. Yes, I am back with another exciting product test. I'm testing out the coolest and latest electronics and products to see if it's worth your hard earned money so you don't have to waste it. All right, so today we have the Vixig magnetic car mount holder. So it looks like it's available on Amazon depending on the size that you want. For the smaller one, it costs you about $27 and for the bigger one, right under $30. So what's cool about this car mount is that it mounts on your rear view mirror. So we've seen and reviewed plenty of different uh, car mounts ranging from dashboard, windshield, CD slot, air vents, uh, cup holders, everything you can think of. So Vixie has a brand new design and I'm excited to review it. So here is what it comes in. And let's go ahead and do a quick unboxing. I'm kind of anxious, excited to see how this will look in my car, guys. So everything you see is everything you get. That is part of the magnetic car mount. And here is the bigger model uh, windshield phone holder for the windshield. Some magnets right here. And the instructions manual. Inside the bag, you see three of the transparent tape along with three magnets, two circular ones and one square one. If you want to use a combination of that, you would follow the instructions guide depending on the type of case do you have so it can uh, stick there properly and work properly with the magnet. All right, so here is the mount itself. The AC is made of plastic. You see buttons and levers. This is where you will pull and extend out, see? So in its retracted state, this measures are 4.3 inches, but when it's fully extended, it goes to 6.5. And here is the leg where you would uh, adjust the 270 degrees. Let's go ahead and put the, the uh, ball joint right here. This is where you can actually uh, stick your phone to. Okay, let's go ahead and tighten that. Before I do that, I need to stick the ball in here. All right, there we go. <laughs> you don't want that just floating in space. All right, next we're going to put the magnet in the phone holder. I'm going to switch my phone. I'm actually recording my Samsung Note 9. I might as well show you how to extend this out. I'm going to extend everything out. All right. So this went from 4.3 inches to 6.5 inches and that went from a height of 2.2 inches to 3.15 and that went from width of uh, 1.18 to 1.77 inches and you simply press the button to snap it back in place and adjust by pressing it. All right, so uh, let's go ahead and put a magnet in the phone holder, uh, depending on the type of phone that you have. By the way, this can uh, fit upwards to phones as big as iPhone 13 Pro Max. So that's the biggest phone available right there. So for my own purpose, I'm just doing simple tests, but you would actually want to peel it off and stick it right there. I just want to do a quick test, okay? I'll we'll put a magnet. I meant the steel in there. That's why it goes with the magnet. See? So I know this with a metal plate in the center of the case. It doesn't support wireless charging because it's in the way. When I relocated to a lower location, it was able to charge, but it would uh, slide around in the holder. So keep that in mind. Alright guys, as you can see, I have a regular dashboard mount right here. So as I start to think, if you already have a rear view mirror, why put an extra product right there when you can just add on to it, right? So less clutter. 
all right so I have everything extended right here by the way these are removable by the way in case you have like a very clunky or special design special with the new cars nowadays there's a lot of electronics devices go into that so depending on your rear view mirror it can be simple like this or very complicated so what I'm gonna do is just fit around it you want to maximize it all right I'm gonna clamp down on the button so all my clamps in I it's a little bit wide right now so I want to close it in I think that's a good look right there see it's centered um, there aren't any buttons it's tight on and you can also s screw it tight by adjusting the knobs in the back I think that looks real good right here but let me align it see so now everything is straight before it was uh, tilted I'm gonna tighten it and let's not forget the back too everything is tightened the length, the width, the height, everything is good. See, and this leg is adjustable. Let me go ahead and put on the phone right here. So we have a landscape option and you can put it at any angle orientation. Don't forget this swivels to, to a, sorry, I was moving the phone. This swivels, all right. Let's say I want an upward angle like that, see? sticks on like that or it can be portrait mode like that for example if you are using GPS or if you are actually doing like a food review here's an awesome feature about it if you don't want to use it you can simply fold it away and hide it away like that okay so let's take this on a test drive you know one thing I really like about having the camera right up close to me so I can see the directions and the upcoming uh, where to turn, or where to exit. But you have to be careful of blind spots, of course. Right. Hitting all these bumps, staying on magnetically. All right. Left, right turn, taking it on a scenic route. Sharp right curve, followed by a left curve. A lot of centrifugal force right there. See the front shaking a little bit? It's remaining intact. That's a strong magnet up to 50 miles per hour let's bring that up 60 all right slow back down slow back down and then I'm gonna wait for this big bump right here Enter right here, hit this big bump. Here we go. Oh yeah, that's good. Wow, 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 I applaud you guys, Vic C. That magnet performed admirably. Even though when I accelerated, doing all these maneuvers, and even hitting the bump, it stayed on properly. Installation is very simple so many different variations you can use with it and i really like this design because that as opposed to a dashboard mount sometimes if you have them on a dashboard people might think it's actual camera and they might attempt to you know bring it to your car and try to steal it so having this doesn't really uh, throw you know thieves off it's easy to use easy to assemble wow i'm totally amazed if you are in the market for a rear view window magnetic car mount definitely check this out especially if you are a uber or a lyft driver this will make wonders especially if you're using gps to look for new locations or even if you are you know grubhub making delivery stuff like that you know what since i am also a food reviewer i bet you i can't even use this as a uh, food review camera what's up guys welcome back to the channel i'm back with another exciting 
product review. Fixie, you're outdoing yourself with this design. Highly recommend it.